Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Google has been testing a new feature in the Chrome web browser over the last couple of months, which I have been posting on. And as many of you know, um, that's the new download bubble and hub that shows up in the top right of the browser on desktop uh, in the toolbar. And when there is a download um, in progress, the button will show up and appear and the progress indicator will move in a clockwise direction uh, in the actual download button. And you can also view your uh, recent downloads, the size of your download, your timestamp for the download. You can also see any downloads that you've removed. And you can click on Show All Downloads, uh, which will take you to the actual downloads page in the browser. Now, I have posted quite a few videos as mentioned. So if you'd like some more information, you can just do a search um, on this channel um, where you will find some more videos um, just to get and look up on some more information if this is of interest to you. Now, this is just a quick video to let you know that um, in Chrome Canary, which is a preview version of the browser, Google has once again started testing another option and feature for the download bubble. And this time the bubble um, now supports dragging and dropping, which I think um, a lot of users, including myself, are going to find quite handy. And um, um, this has now been tested in Chrome Canary. And as I have mentioned previously, the download bubble is not a default feature. Um, you have to enable an experimental flag uh, to um, enable the download bubble. And as many of you would know, how we do this is we head to the address bar, enter chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags. And I've already enabled the flag. So uh, just to uh, demonstrate in case you're unaware, what you would do is you will just enter enable download bubble into the search which will bring up the flag and the description says enables the download bubble instead of the download shelf change the default option to enabled and then you will have to restart and relaunch your browser to apply that flag now just on a side note the download bubble the flag enable download bubble is available in the stable version if you'd like to try it out and i actually have posted on posted on that previously and i will Leave a link to that video as it will just give you more information if you'd like to try that out. But you can enable the download bubble in the stable version using the same flag. But just be aware and take note that the dragging and dropping support will not be available uh, if you do try the feature out in the stable version. That's currently in testing only in the Chrome Canary version. So um, once the flag has been applied, just to demonstrate, if we just minimize that and we go to our downloads bubble you can now drag and drop I can drag that image to my desktop I can take my whatsapp exe I downloaded four hours ago and I can copy and paste that onto my desktop as an example so I think that's quite a nice handy addition and you can also do the same uh, in your file explorer take that image and I can copy and paste that into my file explorer so that's the new dragging and dropping support now available for testing in Chrome Canary and that's just another option uh, that, as mentioned, Google has started to test. So um, uh, there's a good chance that the download bubble uh, with the relevant features, as mentioned in previous videos, including the dragging and dropping support, there is a good chance that that could roll out to a stable version in the future. But like all these um, features that are tested in preview versions, once I get any information, I will keep you posted accordingly. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.